Hello everyone, Shadefire here, and welcome back to Let's Play Dino Crisis for the month or so of Dino. This is episode 5, and I have done a little bit of reading. Not reading ahead because I didn't want to spoil, but I actually read backwards to the stuff we've already done. And it turns out that I can actually open this because there is a note that I missed in the locker room. So let's go check that. At least I believe it's the locker room. If not, it's one of these rooms around here where there's a memo that has the password for that. And I guess there's probably something in there we need. Did I go the right way? No, I did not go the right way. No. I swear I'll get better at this map someday. Alright, so we got this raptor here. Uh, this is the locker room. Hopefully he doesn't chase me in here. He probably will. Okay, a memo. Is it this one? So I might have missed this because didn't this table get broken the first time I came in here by a raptor? Chief and Dr. Kirk will be having a meeting on the second floor lounge from 1 p.m. Those who are scheduled to guard should keep a preponderant eye on the area in front of the chief's room. Before taking positions, resupply from the custody room. The weapon storage in the custody room can be opened with combination 0426. All right. So that would have been, I guess, handy to know earlier. All right. So raptors over here. Why do they call it the custody room if it's the office? I feel like that's just a bad translation for security room. Okay, we got a key. Main entrance. Okay, so we can use that to get outside from the main hall. And maybe we'll find the dead guy out there? I mean, that's as good an idea as any, since I don't really remember any corpses that we could use otherwise. And now, does this go where I want to go? Because we want to get back to the main hall. No, I actually do have to go back the other way again. I guess I will save just because I picked that key up. So yeah, I could have gotten that key way earlier. Though I wonder if there's anything I needed outside. Considering we haven't, you know, run up against a wall until now. In, ter in terms of progress. So maybe I couldn't have done anything out there? Or hey, maybe I can make use of the... The DDK that I don't have a use for yet. Okay, so we're outside. The T-Rex is also outside here somewhere. In fact, it looks like it was here when it bust its head through the window. Some regular shotgun rounds. And he's got an anesthetic aid on him. Anything I can toss? Not really. I really don't need two stacks of resuscitation. Three stacks. So I should probably be tossing those. Okay, so there's the other TDK. So now we should have both ends, which should allow us to open the other door in the main hall. This guy doesn't really have arms. Okay. 
<laughs> but apparently we've fingerprinted something. Oh, maybe there's a hand in there somewhere. Okay, that leads to the heliport, so that's probably where we leave. Five seven zero oh, three six. So this might actually be useful. If I can remember that. Five seven zero oh, three six. And that's also locked. So I don't know if we ever actually will go out into the jungle. Did I already forget what the fingerprint code was? 05726, I believe. I should have just wrote it down. I don't know why this game doesn't let you keep files. I went the wrong way again. I don't know why it doesn't let you pick up files like Resident Evil. You just have to memorize everything you need to know, or you need to go back and check. I got a raptor here, too. They seem to be a lot easier to avoid now. Or maybe I've just gotten better at it, now that I'm familiar with kind of their reactions. Was it 3-6? I wish it would just auto-use this instead of making me select it. His name was Mark, right? Paul Baker, 58104. Let me try that one again. I mean, I'm guessing the phone thing stopped ringing because I... Because I saved and then quit the game. Yeah, that one doesn't work. So I need to go back and try to see what that number is, because I forgot it already. Which again, would be very easily solved by having the ability to pick papers up. Alright, I've got a piece of paper handy to write this down so that I don't forget it a second time. I am going to be disappointed if this is also the wrong one. 57036, not 057. All right. So I had two different numbers wrong there because I thought it was zero at the start, and then at first I thought it was two six. And if this doesn't work, well, I guess we'll just go through the end door and see where that leads. Because even if we rewrite this key card, it might not necessarily be. Oh, I did that. I did it again, again, again. I don't know why I have it just locked in my head that this side of the room leads to the start of the game. There's some sort of, like, a weird memory placement that is forcing me to keep doing that. Okay, so, ID card. 
five, seven, oh, three, six. Finally, we finally did it right. Physics Laboratory, Mark Doyle. Okay, so hopefully that will allow us to access the elevator in the control room, which will then take us down to the area we could see through the gate before. Where we were talking to Gale about. So now, I actually have some idea how to progress. But let's also see what's back here. Okay, so please input the password. So W. No, wait, is it NW? Or is it just W? Because NW doesn't make sense. Right? I'm trying to, like, think of words that might start with NW. Unless we're going... Oh, no, wait, sorry. I think we're going right to left. I was going by columns for some reason. Yeah, so N... E W C O M Newcomer? Yes, I see an E and I see an R. Wah. Okay, this just leads to more elevators. Oh, you know, this... This is also where that dead body we were looking for is. The guy that we were paging. I was gonna say this might actually be the elevators we need to take. Yeah, this looks like it connects down to the area we were looking at. So we probably can't actually go in the elevator in the control room yet. Save the map data. Okay, well I'll take his fingerprints just in case we need his ID, because it's a different access level than the one we just got. And because we don't have to remember the number since it's in the same room as the fingerprint device. So let's see. Okay, this does let us go in the elevator. Oh, I was kind of hoping that I didn't use it right away. Alright, get ready to button mash. I think I did that right. I don't seem to have taken damage. It's okay, so it said with the card now you can go to a certain floor, so I'm wondering if there are more floors we can access with a better card. Let's not go down there just yet, because I want to see what else is up here. Okay, there's a locked door, and there's the elevator. And I think the locked door is locked from our side, yeah. So that connects to the hallway that leads to the lecture room. 
So this gives us a little bit of a shortcut to the ID room if we don't want to go around the outside. Though, there's raptors in both hallways, so I guess it doesn't really matter. Okay, so... It seems like that's all... The oh, right. I want to open this, because this is an ammo box. Need two plugs, which we do have. Okay, 9mm ammo. Shotgun bullets. Poison dart. Yeah, kills an enemy in a single shot. So those are the ones that are very limited. And an intensifier. So not a lot of ammo in here. I don't suppose I can store these. Oh, you can store. Weird that it says you can only store a certain thing. I guess I'll put those in there for now, since it's fairly safe in this room, because I don't think we need, like, six revive items. I, I really would. Well, I think they might actually only stack a ten. I was going to say, I really wish they would just combine automatically. Do I want to take the nine mil? I feel like those are not going to help me very much. And I th think I want to save the intensifier for when I make more. Well, I do have some more anesthetic darts. So I wonder if I can just increase my number of darts, but no, I can't intensify it. So that'll make poison darts, but I think it only gives us one. And I kind of want to save those for now, so... I guess I'll put the intensifier back, and I'll just take the extra shotgun ammo for now. So we'll use that instead of wasting the good one. Well, good is maybe in air quotes. Didn't really seem that much better. I do know that to be most effective, we want to be kind of point-blank range with the shotgun. Otherwise, it won't knock them down. Alright, if this raptor's still here, I might have to kill him. I don't hear him. A more intricate code system has been introduced. In a case where numbers are written instead of letters in the key, the numbers could represent the codes for the corresponding characters. Here is an example of the correspondence chart between the letters and the numbers. The number they are in the alphabet is the number they equal. Hmm. Can I open this shutter? Because that is where we were looking into this room before. Oh, no, there is a raptor in here. But I guess he's probably asleep until I get closer, because he's not... I don't hear him padding around or anything. I wonder if you can just avoid waking him up by walking. Okay, so we got the basement map. So there's a locked door. Or is that the shutter? No, the shutter is on the left of the room I'm in. It divides the room in half. So there's just a locked door that I want to go down that connects to somewhere else. Oh no, he's getting up. Okay, so this is probably the L door, right? Yeah. I'm just going to ignore the raptor imminently about to pounce on me and solve this puzzle. Okay, so... Wait, am I supposed to be entering the numbers in the key, or...? That seems more likely? I don't know. Okay, because it's C, D, E, F, G, H. Right? Those are the letters I'm supposed to subtract, or are those the letters I'm supposed to use?
Laboratory. I had to, like, think about that for a second, but that's what I see. Laboratory. So I wonder where this hallway might lead. There's something in this room. Ow. This is just a really long hall, right? Hey, okay, there's another shutter. What? Oh, shit. Alright, don't try to run that way. I don't know what knocked that raptor down. Okay, there's another one right there. So that seems more effective. You just have to get as close as possible when he's down. Do I need to heal? I don't know. I mean, she's still walking normal, so I guess I don't need to heal yet. Handgun sights. Okay. So that's like the Resident Evil sights. Where you make the handgun custom and then it does headshots more often. I need to go to equip. And I need to... Handgun sights. Oh, you have to equip the gun and then... It's a confusing system. Unnecessarily. So this thing's pretty decent. We still haven't gotten any of the stronger ammo for it, though. Med pack M. Okay, that just leads to another hallway. I don't want to go out there yet. No, well, he followed me in. Now I need to heal. So I think there are a bunch of storage boxes in there that I need specific things to open. plug right now so can't open that one the power is not turned on okay got these supercomputers security manual volume 2 In a case where the numbers are written instead of letters in the key field, the numbers could indicate the columns to be deleted. If 2 is in the keyword, you should delete all of the letters from the second column of the code. So again, these just get unnecessarily complicated. Slot to insert a card key. There's an identical slot on the other side of the monitor. I'm guessing we need somebody else here to do this. Okay, there's another plug. Oops. 
screwdriver. Guess we're going to need that. Do not touch this panel unless the lock system malfunctions. The circuits inside this panel supply the electric power needed for the forced release of the lock. No, I just wasn't standing in the right spot. I don't have to operate this right now. So, can I do anything with the supercomputer right now? Okay. We can unlock areas, but I have no idea what the areas are, so I don't know what to unlock yet. Okay, this room is a save room, so that's handy. That means we have another one. So I guess we just need to find a locked door in an area so we can unlock it. So that doesn't dramatically increase the quality of the med pack, and it does not make an a med pack L, which is one hemostat. Now oh, I do have more and darts. Where did I pick those up? Did I always have those? So this is the library room, right? No, this is the research meeting room. Okay, we haven't been in here yet. DDKE. I don't have another one of those, do Oh, I do. Alright. That's handy. We already have the other one. Panel on the wall. It doesn't do anything. Minute books and files. Yeah, so this is probably the door we need to open. Make sure to lock the door by the computer during experiments. Well, what is this area number? That would be helpful because then I can open it. Another plug. Adding another gas to one with a poison level under 30 may neutralize the gas. Red gas neutralizes the poison in the green gas. Blue gas neutralizes the poison in the orange gas. What is this even about? I guess we have to mix gases at some point. Third energy, a system that can produce infinite energy from the air. The completion of the system will signify the end of one of society's greatest problems. Initially developed for military use, So, is this the scientists who are unaware of this secret laboratory in their laboratory? He hid the clue in our secret place inside the library room. Kirk has been meeting frequently with Colonel Clay, the leader of the project, in the computer room lately. Just imagine how silly it would be for someone to try to militarize raptors. Oh. Wait. Seven four no, wait, seven two four eight, right? So that'll open up this door, and then I assume we'll have to do some gas mixing to make it not toxic. I'm gonna have to look at that again. Seven two four eight. Yeah, 
7248. Four numbers, can't be that hard to remember. I should also have enough plugs to open that weapons box. Though I don't have a lot of space for ammo. Alright, so that opens that. Okay, so there's some 40 Smith & Wesson, slag bullets, shotgun bullets, poison darts. So this one's a pretty good one to open. Uh, I'm going to switch out the shotgun bullets for the slag bullets. I'm gonna grab these 40 Smith & Wesson, because we might actually do something with this friggin' pistol. Now that's got all this stuff attached to it. It's probably still not very good for raptors, though. But maybe it'll actually kill them decently through a laser grid. Alright, so... I guess I'll pop on over to the gas room and see if we can figure out this gas puzzle. Okay. Okay, I was just wondering if I hadn't actually gone through the door from the library, but that just connects back to this hallway. And there's also a med box in here, but I don't think I need it right now. Again, I'm not super hurting for medical supplies. Probably gonna have to write down that neutralizer list. Another med pack. So there's red, or so there's blue, red, and green. Also, there's a man in there who is somehow not dead. They are used to supply the gas to the gas chamber. I mean, it's yellow right now. Or is it orange? So red over green, blue over orange, green over purple. Red, green, blue, orange, green, purple. Wait, I'm going to double check it one more time. I wrote it down, but I think I wrote it down wrong. Red, blue, green, orange, and green, purple also? No, it's blue. All right, got it written down. That'll simplify it, and if we can get it down to 30, then it will neutralize the gas, and we can go in the room. So I assume this is orange right now. 
since yellow is not an option. So let's hit blue, which switches it to blue. Was that blue or is that purple? Let's try green. No, that only raised it. Was it not red green? I feel like that list didn't cover a lot of colors here. Because right now it looks red. But I'm guessing green does not cancel out red. Well, I guess it does. I guess they go both ways. So we're at orange again. Except red green doesn't work, so well, I don't know. Maybe these colors are just not the colors I think they are. So is this not green that I'm looking at right here? Green, purple. That's just blue, and we can't make orange. I'm very confused about this because like, am I just supposed to infer what the other combinations are? Because, I mean, we can't make purple. We can't make... We can't make any of the combination colors. Okay, apparently red also works for blue. I guess red and blue make purple? So that makes sense. Okay, so it's back to green. So, how can we make this orange? We don't want to do red, because obviously that doesn't work. Oh no, we're just back here again. So, blue doesn't work here, red doesn't work here. Let's try green. Does that just make it very green, and now I should do red? Apparently so. And now we're at orange, so blue. Alright, I feel like maybe the colors were a little off there, but figured it out in the end. Without gassing the guy to death. Uh, he should be very poisoned, though. You're gonna be okay. What happened? Mm. That... that fool. Who are you talking about? What are you planning, Kurt? I'm here with the rescue team. Where is Dr. Kirk? Here. This will give you access to his... personal... Okay. Small size key. Hmm. I know where that is. That's the other save room. I'm just wondering if that's anything good. It might be a weapon upgrade. You're not Dr. Kirk. Yeah, gas the raptor. I 
Excellent. So we got that chip, but I don't know where that chip would actually go. I don't know if I just stick it in the elevator, or if it's for the room with the two slots and I need another chip. Because if that's the case, I'm guessing the other chip is in the library room. And maybe that number written on the one we got will let us withdraw the other chip we need. Or I should find out how effective these bullets are. I'm at like five shots now. And now I can't tell which raptor's which. Because they're in sync. One of them's kind of limping. Oh, see, I hit the wrong one. She keeps like switching which one she's snapped locked onto. I'm just gonna. gonna bite the bullet on that wasted ammo and not. Try to double down on those raptors. They're not exactly in a particularly problematic place for me. I sought to insert a card key, so that's maybe not what I need. Unless that chip will literally just get us the box we need to get the like key card or whatever. So I guess we'll save it here. Because it seems like we've made some good progress and are getting closer to finding Dr. Kirk, presumably. But, uh, I don't know. There might still be a lot of game left. Could have sworn this game was at least, like, six hours estimated. So, maybe I am not nearly as far as I think I am. But, next time, we'll head into the library and see if we can grab whatever we need to grab. And then at some point, we'll make the trip back upstairs and go open those small boxes, because I bet there's something handy in there. Till next time, I've been Shadefire, this is Dino Crisis, and I hope you'll join me for some more of a month or so of Dino, both with Dino Crisis and some other stuff. Till then, take care everyone.